We're here because we've had the different prosecutorial agencies tell us they can't really complete their investigation because they haven't yet figured out what the cause of death is. They say they want to hear from the coroner on an autopsy. They say they're not sure what it is that killed Kelly Thomas. I think the evidence is pretty clear. Now, Kelly Thomas died because of blunt head trauma. That blunt head trauma caused multiple fractures of bones in and around his face. So, brain death, head trauma. What could have caused that? He certainly didn't have a bad cold. He wasn't suffering from any other illness. He had, some people ask, well, what kind of drugs did he have? Or was he drunk? He was homeless. Maybe he was out in the streets. And the answer is they did a complete study. He had no alcohol in his system. He had no drugs in his system. He was as sober as all of us. And yet they beat him to death. And we're just looking at the black and white. There's no spin here. You see the cause of death. You see the doctor's signature. And you see blunt head trauma. You see assault. You see brain death. And so it's pretty clear.